Happy Easter Sunday. It is a beautiful day today. Gotta get out here and get a few things done before we go have lunch with my folks. Good morning, friends. Where's Bean Machine? That's up there. Did let the boys out yesterday. Tony, what are you doing? Just grumping. Um, no new babies. It has been really nice. We didn't end up getting any bad weather on Tuesday, which was great. What are you guys doing? How is everybody this morning? How are the gremlins? Gosh, Pepper, we need to brush you. It's a problem, buddy. That is sad. Okay, so brush Pepper on the agenda today, huh? Hello, hello my little two dudes. Ready for breakfast? Let's have breakfast. Come here. food, but we just all want to eat out of this bowl. Nice there. Bunny's confused. Buns, have breakfast, honey. Y'all just gotta figure it out. You gotta figure out how to, I know. Five of you in here is too many. We gotta figure out something else. With that, the little girls are eating grain, which is fantastic, but they haven't quite figured out that like grain exists when their mom is not eating it, so I gotta teach them because they're babies. Good morning! Good morning, my silly bears. Yes, mom has food for everyone. All right, come on, piggies. Come on, piggies. Here we go. Oh, oh no. Well, I dumped the majority of their food out. Oops, there is plenty of grass, so not a huge deal, but we have quit giving them food at night because there is plenty of grass to eat. They don't need that supplement anymore. It's much warmer than I thought it was, which is excellent. All right, girls. Sally, still very pregnant. Uh, Utter still big. I don't know her. Patty, what do you think? Good morning. Good morning, everyone. Gotta get a brush after Pepper today. Hello! All right, Buns. Come on, girl. Here we go. Here we go. throw up a fourth net today. Also need to brush Pepper. He is shedding so badly and he looks as if no one takes care of him. Watch out, Cinnamon. These babies are like legit all about grain. And me, which is fun. We'll check on Padme. 
I don't know about Zelda. I looked back at all my videos and things, and unless I bred her the same day as Padme and just didn't talk about it, she's due the 18th and she's just probably having a lot of babies is all I can figure out. She normally doesn't fill her udder up quite like this. I think that's unusual. I gotta brush this mat so I'll pepper real quick. So if you look at Zelda's udder, uh, it's definitely big. It's looked full. She's not had ligaments. I, I guess we're gonna get an even bigger pop for her udder, uh, but we'll see. I don't know. Pepper, they being mean to you. Somebody just being mean to you. I'm just trying to get some of this off you. Apparently we're going to have to wait until after breakfast because Zelda's just going to chase me in a circle. Padme has me a little concerned. She's wide, but I, no udder development yet, like at all. I'm wondering if she's even pregnant. She's due tomorrow. I mean, Pixie has way more udder development than her being about a week out. She has almost no udder development. We're just not very big. And I'm wondering if she was pregnant and maybe lost to the babies. She is pregnant, she probably only has one. Hi, sweeties. I just don't, I don't know. I think this one may be a fake out. I think she may not have ever been pregnant. And she's had a couple of times on and off where she seemed to go back into heat. Not a very strong heat, but I think she may not be pregnant. This one's definitely pregnant. Zelda obviously is definitely pregnant. She may not be. And that's okay, and that's not her problem. Like we talked about in the fall, that's probably a buck issue for us. Um, I don't think Bean was completely healthy after his bout with whipworm, going into fall breeding. Was your daddy just not completely healthy? And Luke's old. I mean, just straight up, Luke is just an, an elderly gentleman with a lot of arthritis at this point. And so that may be, that is more than likely our problem. I am not gonna buy another buck. We're just gonna do with what we have because most of my girls are retirement age or approaching that in the next few years anyway, other than Nugget and if she doesn't ever breed, it doesn't really matter to me. She's also really small and it's gonna be, like she's not gonna be ready to even breed this fall. She's so small still. She's gotta be at least as big as Pixie and Poppy who are my smaller two. Um, and she's not really as big as Tink yet. She just didn't grow right. Parker's a bottle baby, so he's gonna be a slower grower in general. But like, her sisters may outgrow her before they leave, y'all, you know, these, these guys. I mean, it's like this. I can't get away from them. They are under my feet, crawling on me. You are, aren't you? They were mom's best friends. We are, and they're super sweet, but they are wild. Absolutely wild. These two could care less about me. Just really don't think this one, this one may just not be pregnant. And that's disappointing, but we'll watch her the next couple of days. She has really till the end of this week. So like Thursday or Friday before I would say not pregnant. Just not making changes the way that I would anticipate. She could just have one baby and it's just, she doesn't need to be that prepared. The way Zelda looks, we're having several and this one. Definitely. And Pixie is a, a year older than Padme. You are, aren't you? Do, you? do you need to do that? Yeah. I don't I don't think you do. I'm having some breakfast. Those are some big babies. These two littles. They were duper small. They were duper small. But we're only two weeks old. Are we only two weeks old?
pants up, but they stayed in, which was good. <laughs> These friends. So everybody's like super duper mad and ready to come out. You guys ready? Okay, okay. Mad at me. Watch out, babe. Yes. May I help you? But just want to chew your pants, Mom. Come on, let's go. Let's go, come on. Let's go with everybody else. can't get the ground rod out of the ground so the chargers having to stay in that's probably a mistake they'll probably chew the cables because that's what goats do but hopefully uh, there's enough to entertain them yes is there enough to entertain you neighbors burning over there but they got you can kind of see the edge right there all this new space so that took them about the extension took about two weeks for them to eat down probably keep them two weeks on this add the fifth net and then probably work them back if the grass has come in and let it rest <laughs> look at you letting them be way out here with you where's Al mm, oh, there he is he's over with Nani so definitely longer a lot more to eat it's just that time of year. It is grass season, which means lots of rotational grazing to keep everybody healthy. Yeah, mm-hmm. That didn't go the way that you wanted, did it? That's not your mama. <sighs> this girl. Y'all, how many babies do you think she's gonna have? Like, if we're really still a week and a half away, she's got at least half four in there. Yeah, what do you think, Cinnamon? Do you think you're gonna have four brothers and sisters? These are Luke babies. If she is due the next time, uh, on the 18th, then it, those are Luke, both for she and Pixie. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Nibble, 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 nibble. Ow. Hmm, you're chewy. You're a chewer, Miss Cinnamon. Miss Cinnamon. Hmm. Our sweet baby. Yeah, good baby, mama. I go baby. Waddle, waddle, waddle. What about Pixie? Uh huh. What do you think, Dahlia? You hang with your mama? 